You know, because I interact with so many women, of course, the conversation always ends up talking about relationships and dating and marriage and just trying to navigate all of that. And one of my books that I wrote is called Follow Your Heart, But Take Your Brain With You. The earlier version was desperation is a terrible perfume to wear. And in the book, I share a metaphor that I, I really thought was so cool. And I thought about the times that I would go grocery shopping. And if I was really hungry, if I was starving, I'd end up putting all types of junk food in my basket. I mean, the cakes, the cookies, the soda, the chips, all the things that are harmful would end up in my basket because I was hungry. I was starving. But I noticed that if I go grocery shopping and I'm already fulfilled, uh, I'm not hungry, I'm centered, I tend to make better choices about what I purchase. And I think it's the same thing with relationships. When a person is starving for relationships, starving for companionship, starving for attention, starving to be married, to get a ring on their finger, they'll end up putting the wrong things in their relationship basket. They'll end up with junk food. They'll end up compromising their health and their values and their standards. And so I want to remind you all, we wear your crown, know who you are, know that you're a precious jewel in God's sight. You are a diamond and don't go around looking for relationships when you're starving and you're not already fulfilled. Work on your own self-worth and your self-esteem and know that as you become whole and as you become uh, centered in who you are and your self-care and your self-worth and your self-esteem, you will not attract somebody that is junk food. You will attract someone who sees your value because you're wearing your crown and you know that you are a diamond. You know that you are a jewel. So let this be a warning. Do not go shopping for food or relationships while you are starving and you are hungry. This is Jewel Diamond Taylor the self-esteem doctor. God bless you and stay in the light.